Hey guys, it's Christina with the Thomas Group and Real Broker, your local Las Vegas and Henderson Realtors. Today, I'm going to do something fun and show you all of my top seven hidden local favorites here in Las Vegas. So my first number one spot is actually right here at Horse Trailer Hideout. So this place, if you're coming in from the street, we're in downtown Las Vegas here. From the street, it's really kind of small and kind of hidden. You don't really realize how much there is to it, but as you carry on through, you can see that there's just so much here. It's got this kind of country chic vibe to it and delicious cocktails. Horse Trailer Hideout was established in 2018. This country chic bar offers a wide variety of cocktails inspired by local flavors as well as wine and beer. And another really cool fact is that all of the products are fully biodegradable, which makes it really uh, environmentally friendly as well as delicious. And this is my particular favorite cocktail called the Lavender Lush. Next is Velveteen Rabbit. Velveteen Rabbit is located in the Arts District and from the street it's an extremely unassuming building. You would never even know what's inside. You can't see, there's no windows to be able to see inside the building and it's just a black exterior. So actually the first time I went to go look at this, check out this restaurant and bar, um, I actually had trouble finding the front door. So <laughs> um, once you know what is there, you go inside and it's this beautiful kind of red mood lighting, really a lot of like um, vintage decor. They feature a lot of local artists. And one of the coolest things is that they have a seasonal menu. So they're constantly changing their cocktails. Um, and so it's something different every time, something new and fun to experience. Um, they offer happy hour from 5 to 7 p.m. every day. Next, we have Sand Dollar Lounge, located just minutes west of the Las Vegas Strip. So this small, unassuming bar has hosted many famous bands such as the Rolling Stones, The Who, and Fishbone, as well as many local artists. You can definitely find many locals hanging out here at all hours of the day after they get off work because they're open from 4 p.m. till 4 a.m. They also serve some delicious pizza. Next, we have Star Lounge. Now, this building is a small building located on Sammy Davis Jr. Drive. It's kind of tucked away and hidden, so you don't really necessarily notice it when you're driving by. But once you go inside, you go through a tunnel with LED lighting and then you're in this main open bar area with live music. They have dueling pianos and live local artists that perform there all the time. And of course, they serve plenty of delicious cocktails, wine and bubbly drinks. Next is Golden Tiki, located on the west side of Las Vegas, just about 15 minutes from the Las Vegas Strip. And this is definitely a local favorite. It's open 24 hours a day with happy hour from 4 to 7 p.m. And they also have Sunday brunches from 12 to 3 p.m. They also have plenty of food, island inspired food and drinks, live DJs. And this is definitely a fun hangout spot for mostly your local vibes. And you better go there and have fun, just like me. Oh, I'm tall. I should be better at this. <laughs> oh, I got one. <laughs> no. Okay, well, at least I got one in. <laughs> Another cool local spot is called Other Mama. And this is a very hidden gem here in Las Vegas. It's actually on the southwest side of Vegas. And it's actually located inside a strip mall. So from the outside, you definitely would not expect what you see when you go through the doors. Inside, you've got lots of really cool marine style decor. It was opened by award-winning chef Daniel Cromer, and they have amazing sushi and raw bar there, as well as really unique cocktails. They're open from Tuesday through Sunday from 5 to 10 p.m. The last one for today is Herbs and Rye, also located on the west side. Herbs and Rye is in this dark, unassuming building, but again, once you go inside, you have a really different vibe. 
We've got leather couches, dark wallpaper, dark lighting, and really that intimate feel. It kind of has like a speakeasy type vibe. They call themselves a steakhouse. So they say we make pretty good steak and really good cocktails. Um, I myself don't eat steak, but they also have a lot of vegetarian options there as well. And they definitely have some really delicious cocktails, um, especially ones involving whiskey. Thanks so much for watching this video of the local hidden favorites here in Vegas. And if you're moving to Las Vegas and you would like to schedule a free consultation, feel free to reach out to us at the Thomas Group LV.com. All of our contact information is there and my extension is four for Christina. Try out all of these local faves and let me know which one's your favorite in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next video.